Hello everyone. This video is about the wonderful neem. Uh, many of us use neem oil for our plants and our bodies and it's a wonderful product. It's loaded with a lot of uh, wonderful properties and I don't need to go on and on to explain to you what good it is. The video is actually about the plant. So it is a beautiful plant besides all the wonderful properties it has. And uh, yeah, it's a beautiful, beautiful plant. It is here in San Diego. Uh, today is October 24th, 2020. And this is how well it's doing. It's approximately 5'5", five, 5'6". Five, five, the pot is a 15 gallon pot, very well drained. And it loves humidity, that is a key. Humidity is important for this plant. And as we know, San Diego is now turning into the regular um, fall season. So it's getting a little cold. Not quite, but it is uh, time to think about where I'm gonna put my plant. I have had neem tea, especially now with the pandemic. I have chewed leaves and as you may see this is a very plentiful plant I think I've done a really really nice job it's very healthy very happy uh, you can see the stem it's getting really thick I have put some plants next to it so it protects the other plants from uh, insects and pests it is getting partial sun so at about 10 a.m the sun comes out of that wall and it gets sun until about five o'clock in the summer of course now that it's gonna get darker sooner it's probably gonna get less sun but i'm gonna move it over there so it gets the same amount of sun or i may have to move it inside in my apartment which has a really large window and it gets some sun in the middle of the day um, let me see what this plant was a little weak because it had a bunch of plantain herb not the plantain uh, fruit but the plantain herb right next to it and this is a really hungry plant so what's eating all the nutrients from my neem so I took all that out put new soil and now it's all by itself with enough drainage, which is really important. When I water it, I make sure that I water the leaves too, because it likes humidity again. And uh, it's doing really well. It's growing new leaves. I made one plant out of a branch and I haven't checked with my friend who I gave it to to see how it's doing. I'm hoping that I can reproduce this wonderful tree or plant and uh, have other people benefit from the wonderful properties of neem. 
and it grows to be really high it's like uh, 40 or 50 feet I've learned but I don't know how well it would be being on the ground and um, going through the cold weather the cold seasons in San Diego uh, in this spot it's been about maybe three years and again it's about five six tall including the pot and it loves it here I guess the heat of that wall is also keeping it warm at night but I will try to figure out where to place it now that the cold season is coming and I have to check it for a month or so to see if it will adapt to the cold season or if I have to take extra precautions to keep it alive but it has it has in the past it has been outside the whole year it was not as happy as now but it survived and it is a strong beautiful plant if you like this video please press like and share I would appreciate it and thank you for watching Neem in San Diego Possible to keep, possible to grow. Thank you. Bye.